the purpose of this lesson is to learn how to model a sphere in SketchUp, and we will learn about the Trim Tool. All right, let me pan over for your viewing pleasure. Use your hot finger, hotkey C. Now notice over here it says 24. That means my circle will have 24 sides. I'd like it to be smoother, so I will change it to 48. All right, let's lay down a base circle. Size doesn't matter right now. Use your finger, toggle to green, go back to the center, and create another circle perpendicular. Good. Now with the select tool, we will select the base, come over, choose the follow me tool, Select the circle that's perpendicular. Ah, we have a sphere. All right. Let's select the base again, and we will delete it. Okay. Now we have a sphere. Now let's create a rectangular prism. There we go. All right, select. Let's remove our person. Now we will push pool. We have a rectangular prism. All right. Let's turn this into a group. Select. Right click. Make group. Now we will have to triple click the sphere and we will make it a group as well. All right, now let's choose the move tool and we are going to move the sphere into the rectangular prism. Any position is fine. This looks good. All right. Bring back the select tool. Now we will bring up the trim tool. It's important to remember that the timing of your clicks is very important. The first click will be the cutter. The second click will be the object that's getting cut. Click the sphere first, then the rectangular prism. Now we must move the sphere away. And we have a nice cutout. Ah, this is great. I hope you have learned something about making spheres and trimming objects.